So first, before programming, we have to send, put it on the arrow, the line trigger, and we have to press the round button two times gently. And after that, we have to, we can put it anywhere. And since this is a lab controlling driving, we have to put it on, we have to press this once, so now it's ready. So now we can press this, this is a sound detector, and it can detect sounds. And after you can press it one time, example, this time slash. We press this two times and this will go front. Okay, so now I'm gonna put this on the ground for clarification. And as you can see, once I put the ground, it goes front. And if we press, this is a sound detector. So if we press it one, it will go left. And if we clap it, it, it also goes left. Tap two times and it, it can move forward. So as you can see, this is how the clap control works. So now I will tell you that how to control Edison by your remote of any Edison. So now I will control these Edisons by barcode by scanning a barcode. And press this 
control this button is for play this is for stop this is for record here is here is a so now we are we are going to program it we have just to click this gently it have control uh, it have record the now it's ready after scanning the barcode Actually, it's played. We have to just press this button. It is active. Now it's going back backward because you only recorded the back code. When I scan this barcode, it will drive forwards, and when I scan this one, it will play tune. Two times, and when it 